beautiful people and welcome back to Uniquely Sorrel. It is Sorrel here and I am so glad to talk to you guys today about, okay, I just want to, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, wait, wait, okay, I gotta get situated. I just want to have like a conversation between me and you, okay? And I really want to talk about what has been on my mind lately, you know, what's going on going on and everything like that right so I mean to start off I just do want to say that life has been great and I am not the type to complain about anything and everything that I come across but I do want to say that I have been having some issues lately about some certain things and one of them being so many people complain about the things that they go through the things that they experience and they're like, why do I go through this, blah, blah, blah. I'm just here to tell you that you control every single action of your life. And if you don't like the things that you're going through, you can alter some of the decisions that you make. If you are going to parties and you do not like everybody around you drunk, then stop going to parties. And then, like, you're going to complain about, like, all these people drunk around you when you chose to go to the party. It's those type of scenarios that people are um, complaining about and I'm just lost. I'm like, I thought you were smart. No, no, I'm just kidding. I'm not calling you guys stupid at all, but I'm just saying, don't complain if it's your fault. And a lot of people, like they don't see it as their fault, but it really is because you alter every decision in your life. So another thing, that's that's one thing, is complaining about things that is in your control. I could see if it was somebody else's fault, if somebody else did something, but if you did it and if you put yourself in that situation, then don't complain about it. And also if, okay, so let's say there was a guy or a girl with their boyfriend or girlfriend and then they got cheated on, right? And this happened and they said like, I'm never um, getting in a relationship until I'm sure that this person is the one. And then a month later, they get in another relationship and then they get cheated on again. Did you think this through or did you just get in another relationship just to be doing it? Like, what, what are you doing? Like, you know what I mean? Do you see, do you feel the, see the grief that I'm cooking with? Like, I just don't understand that how people, how people do that. And then you complain when something goes wrong. Like, think, think about what you're doing before you do it. And then don't complain about it when it happens to you if it's your fault. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, also, I mean, I guess these are just some of my pet peeves, I guess. I don't know what it is. I just feel like to make a better life, like, I don't like when people say they hate their lives. I don't like when people say, I wish I wasn't here. I don't like when people say that type of, those type of things. Because number one, you could be just seeking attention. And I don't really enjoy attention seekers. And two, I mean, I don't even know what I was just talking about, so I don't even know what two is. Um, but, I mean, it's different factors that come with um, those things. Y'all, I legit just forgot what I was talking about. Ah, now I gotta rewatch the video. Wait, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Anyways, before I forgot my lovely topic... <laughs> Um, I'm going to start with just saying, um, just enjoy, enjoy your life and don't complain about it because I mean, I'm a, I gotta say that I'm a positive person just about every day. I mean, I go through things and people will say, um, like you don't go through anything because you're always positive, negative statement. Okay. I, I told you guys like three times I've been through so, so, so much and I just don't put my information out there. I don't really put statuses like F my life. I don't I don't even cuss. So, um, I mean I don't I don't seek attention. So I'm not the type of person to put my life out there, you know? The people that need to know know. But um yeah, I just do want to tell you guys to appreciate this beautiful, precious life that we have because I mean we always take things for granted. That's actually gonna be another video, taking things for granted because we're here, we're here to love. We're not here to complain about our situations. 
we are here to live life and if if you are having a hard time in life sorry but all I can tell you is that's life because we go through things I mean we're gonna cry we're gonna be angry sometimes you know you're going to go through these different stages and it sucks but that's what life brings you sometimes and it's a beautiful thing either way because those those um those things that you cried about, those things that you were angry about, those always turn into blessings. At least for me, they do because you always learn from your mistakes and you always grow from that. So, um, so you can prevent anything worse from happening later in your life. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I just do want to say to appreciate every single thing that comes in your life because we only get one of these guys. We only get one, and I mean, heaven is gonna be a beautiful place. Like. God saving me a spot and but he also saved me a spot on this earth and not everybody got a spot so I'm just very grateful so I think you should be grateful too yes and actually very soon you guys are gonna see me um wearing my uniquely Sorrel sweatshirt and it's going to say focus inspire speak and be unique on it and somewhere it's gonna say uniquely Sorrel and I hope you guys like it. Like, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, merch. I cannot believe God is doing amazing things. Like, I cannot tell you the journey that I've come across from third grade to now. Mind blown. I'm trying to tell y'all. Um, so yeah, just keep sending me topics, guys, because I mean, I love talking about things that you guys love to hear. I don't want you guys to be bored, you know, because I mean, no, I'm not a boring person. So Anyways, I love you guys to pieces. Like my heart goes out to all of you out there because you're you're taking the time out to watch this. So I love you so much. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your love. And do not forget to focus, inspire, speak, and be unique. Love you so much. Bye. Mwah.